Hey guys, no subscribers guy back again for another episode in the Minecraft Inspiration series. Today I'm going to be building a simple, small sandstone house. So here we go, here's the materials I'll be using today. Should we begin? May as well, pretty quick, pretty easy. So, one bit of sandstone, two bits, of, three bits of sand, two bits of sandstone, three bits of sand, one bit of smooth sandstone, smooth sandstone I'm using there at the moment. Right, so that's the first simple layer, pretty easy to do to be honest. One, three, two, three, one, like that. I'm gonna go around here, do that. There's only two, it's two bits of sand, one smooth sandstone, three bits of sand. Instead of smooth sandstone, actually, I'm going to do a bit of sand there, a bit of stairs there, facing that way. A stair facing me, and on this end, another stair facing me. I'm going to layer that up. That's layer one. That's layer two, three, four, this is five high. It's five blocks high overall. Two, three, four, five. And over here, two, three, three, four, five, two, three, four, five. And here, don't forget, layer two, three, three layer four, and layer five. Then fill in the sides with sandstone. Just plain sandstone blocks for here. In these side bits here, looking pretty good to be honest. Like so. And the same with this here. You want sandstone blocks. Like so. And here. In the, no sandstone blocks in here, you want plain glass window planes to be honest. I don't know why I just said that. Plain glass window planes. So we're getting this going. If it's going too quickly, I'm sorry. Just uh, pause the video and, and copy. Kind of looking like this at the moment. And hopefully it will turn out to be quite nice in the end actually. Looking pretty good so far. Two bits of sand. Get a slab in here. Sandstone slab. Then in here, sand. Two bits of chisel sandstone and some sand like that. Then we're going to get to the roof. Or at least the beginnings of a roof there and on top of the stair get rid of the stair place that there and place a very important to place a stair next to, actually no yeah a stair on the outside one because we'll be going over this edge by one like that and then to replace the stair important to replace the stair there and there and there and in there, on top of here, like so, and there, like that. So we got that going there. Then get some sand, just place it in this little uh, triangle shape, obviously, over the top of here. Quite easy, quite simple, quite nice, to be honest. Like that. Then put the stairs over. Nothing too complicated yet. But you know, this build actually is quite easy to be honest, I I think it's easy, I think it looks really, really, really good actually. Quite a really nice little sandstone house, that you could you could even build on survival if you wanted to, so so far we've got that going. Now I'm going to place upside down stairs in, it's not there, facing that way, underneath here. Like so. 
So you've got that going. It's a bit it's a bit thicker of a roof, which I'm, I think it looks quite nice to be honest. A little bit, a little bit more realistic, if I might say. I might throw that world word into the world of Minecraft. It's got a little bit more realism to it. Which is good. Now I'm just gonna finish off by curving around this roof here. Like so. Now, I know that's quite quick, so I'll stop. Alright, enough time? No, alright. We'll wait a couple seconds, so that's what it's looking like so far. Really quite nice, actually, to be honest with you. Really simple, you know? Then I'm going to get some smooth sandstone, two smooth sandstone, one chisel sandstone, and then two smooth sandstone. Leaving a gap of one there, leaving another gap of one there. And the same pattern repeats. Then in the bottom, sand. And then a window of three high, a single window of three high. And then another bit of sand on the top. Like that. There. <laughs> That's that roof. Or that part of the house. And we'll put a roof over its head. Very important, you know, you get your roof over your head. Like sand in there, although we're, we're going to replace the sand over there in a few minutes or so. But for now, we'll use it to help build the roof. We'll do that there. Like so, and then obviously you need the underneath sections. Like so. Actually, that was looking good. It's not perfectly symmetrical, so the windows are actually slightly to the left of where the roof is, but I think that makes the house look a bit nicer, to be honest. Not sort of so, um, I don't know how to put it, too, you know, unrealistic. Perfectly symmetrical house is just really un unrealistic and not very nice, to be honest, as well. But with that, we can connect the roofs up. The roof? The roof. Yeah. And connect that bit there like so giving us that that actually wonderful house <laughs> wonderful looking house we might even be as tempted at that's a bit of sand um <laughs> wrong block there tempted as far as to add a porch in like that what do you think i'm thinking pretty good but what material? What could we use to support this? Hmm. Iron bars? No. Can we get some fence in here? Can we get some birch fence. It's birch and sandstone, very similar looking blocks, aren't they? You know, if you can compare them one to each other, they're quite simple. So we get some birch. We'll um, do that there because obviously it's it's a it's a hanging roof. It needs some support, like so. Actually, I'm thinking this is starting to look pretty pretty nice. Actually, here, gonna add some upside down stairs. Get some spruce leaves. I'm just gonna get some spruce in there. Get spruced like that. Just to add a bit of green to our building. It's looking good. I definitely like the stairs on the corners. Actually, they're looking pretty good. At this moment, they are looking quite fabulous, should we say. No, they're good. They're really nice, actually. I like it. It's a good build. And it's quite easy to do. It's quite easy to follow. Quite easy to, you know, build, obviously. It's not too many materials required. It's actually pretty basic build. Okay, let's get back to here. We've got this huge bit here, just sands in between here. Or if we place some um, upside down stairs in there, that'll do. Should create a little bit more of um, a pattern, something nicer than just plain sand up there. Fill that in with sand there. Like that. Let's get a door. What doors do we have? Four? Four. No, we need a door. Door. 
Oof, how many doors are there? Um, oof, I, haven't, I haven't seen any of the new doors recently. So here we go. We've got the traditional oak one. Uh, should have a look at the spruce one as well. How does that look in the... How does our original doors look? So the oak one actually looks pretty good in there. How does the spruce one look in there? Okay. What other doors have we got other than the spruce? A birch door? No, I did not put the birch door in. That's the spruce door again. Well, that's a birch door. Hmm, that's actually quite nice for the sandstone you need to sort of look we get going here. Let's get a jungle door, see what we get with a jungle door. Okay. Just experimenting, I haven't seen any of these new door designs yet. They were released in this update. Okay, wow. Hmm. Now let's check out the last one, some dark oak. I like it. I love it. I'm gonna have a dark oak door. An inset one. So I put them there. So if you go around again, there's our dark oak door. Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now let's get ourselves a button. Because a stone button. And there. Opens the door. And it's also like a, a doorbell. Which is cool. Because I like the look of doorbells. I've done. That should look nice anyway. And there. That'll be part one. Actually, that's going to end us for part one, to be honest, today. We've got, you know, like, at least two of the walls done. And some of the roofing as well. So, I'm thinking it's looking pretty good, actually, so far. Although, I'd like to know how you feel about the look of the build so far. Although, all I can say is that, you know, please, um... Please stick around for part two, which will be coming out in the next in the next few days, hopefully. And all I can say is, you know, I've been the No Subscribers Guy, and thank you for watching.